Well, it would be a busy Tuesday at Raider Sports once again. As girls soccer fights to a scoreless tie with Dedham, we head over to field hockey. Winners of their last six and allowing only one goal in those games, this team continues to build more confidence with each opponent they face. And why not, as each victory gets them closer to reaching their postseason goals. Also facing Dedham in this opening period, Wellesley is aggressive attacking the cage early, and that quickly pays off when a great pass by Alexis Y finds Mimi Connor's stick. The ball deflects off it, but Connor stays with it, collects it in the crease, and finds right corner cage. Wellesley jumps out with the lead first yet again, one to nothing. Still holding on to that one goal advantage right before we go into halftime, Raiders are looking for more. Alex Ramson feeds it into the crease. The fight for the ball continues in front of the net, but instead, Luisa Coakley reaches out with her stick to give Raiders a commanding 2 0 edge going into the second. Final half begins with Dedham desperate to spend some time, any time, on their own offensive side of the field and finally get a chance here. In corner penalty, Sarah Nelson starts it and passes it to Christina Mitchell. But solid defense from Phoebe Lawrence and Sophie Vernon, not once, but twice, denies Mitchell. The ball gets hit out of bounds by Vernon, and that Marauders opportunity quickly gets rejected. Wellesley would add yet another score to make it 3-0, and as Dedham cannot provide any answers, this 3-0 lead would be a final here. Raiders once again jump out early with the lead, and their defense shuts out the Marauders for 50 solid minutes and Wellesley continues to impress. So we head over to girls volleyball where these Raiders, coming off a loss to Natick last Thursday, take on the struggling and winless Marauders of Dedham. So Marauders take the first three points of this opening set, but two quick mistakes by Dedham easily gives Wellesley the points right back, and now it's tied up at three. A close match would continue here in the first set, but that changes as soon as Wellesley takes a two-point lead on this key spike by Joanna Breeden-Stevens. That gives Raiders a 15-13 advantage, and that helps carry the momentum back to Wellesley's side when they pull away from here, taking the first match 25-18. Taking the second as well to the score of 25-15, we head to the third set, where Wellesley would be looking for the classic sweep, so it's up to Dedham to find a way to respond. Emirates would jump out early with the lead like they did in the opening match and are up 5-1. to one. But the Raiders start to fight their way back in and tie it up at 13 apiece with another well-placed spike by Joanna Braden-Stevens. But Marauders work hard to score four more points unanswered before Raiders have to call a timeout, with Dedham now leading 17-13. to 13. Dedham continues to nail the timely spikes and take the third set by the score 25-18 staying alive for another match, now down 2-1. to one. So we fast forward halfway into the fourth here, with Wellesley holding a 9-5 lead. Mistakes again by Marauders, though, continue on this serve by Grace Majacomo, as Dedham's counter shot just gets looked at by the Marauders, and the ball bounces out of bounds, giving another point to the Raiders, and Wellesley leads here 17-11. Megan Harrington's counter shot is placed perfectly as a Dedham player dives, but the ball is hit out of play once again. Margaret Dosher lays down this perfect serve here that falls for a key Raiders ace. And after Marauders quickly get back two points, Jessica Sawyer puts a resounding stop to any possibility of a Dedham comeback with this hard spike. And that point gives Wellesley a 23-17 lead. So Raiders hold on and take the fourth set as well, 25-17 and win this contest by the final score, 3-1, to one, as this Dedham team still remains winless and Wellesley improves to a commanding 9-1 to one record. That does it for this week's edition of Raiders Sports Block, but stay with us as more Raiders action comes your way. Wellesley Media will keep you up to date with all Raiders highlights and games. So check us out on demand at wellesleymedia.org, our YouTube channel at Wellesley Public Media, and right here, Comcast 9 and Verizon 39.